Yeah, I think, um, you know, one person I've talked about this a lot has been Coach Goulden. You know, he's been around the NFL and been to a lot of places. And he told me, you know, as things go in football, you know, the, it's kind of like nothing really changes the way that the plays are run, everything going on, just the verbiage and kind of the scheme and kind of the way that you attack changes. So it's been good that I've been able to learn three offenses going on my third, obviously, and new terminology. So it, it's fun. It's another challenge, but having a good time learning and really just diving in to learn more about football. And then how do you go about building a rapport with these new receivers? Is it just extra throwing sessions or is it spending time with them off the field? Or yeah, it's both, like you just said, uh, you know, extra work that goes on outside and really just spending time with those guys like off the field. Like it means a lot, um, you know, when you're coming into college. Like I was once a mid-year, like I said, and guys took me under their wing and showed me the ropes. So that means a lot. And then really like – when you make plays with them and, you know, getting in these RBA periods and, you know, stuff where you're able to just throw a lot of balls and see how they run routes one-on-ones, it means a lot just getting time in and feel for those guys. But overall, you know, the new guys that have came in, we've been building a great relationship and looking to keep Coach, going. Coach Gnulli said uh, last year you were able to sit and watch and learn from yeah. Sam. What, what did you pick up from yeah. him that you're utilizing while you're putting it to your yeah. system? I mean, there's countless things. You know, every time I – you know, get in front of you guys, I credit Sam for teaching me kind of a lot of stuff that he's learned. Like I said, he's, he's a guy that played a lot of ball, and, you know, there's a lot of stuff that he's taught me, especially from the preparation aspect. So throughout the whole season, even though I'm not the starter, I'm preparing like I am every practice I'm going through, preparing like I'm taking the ones reps. And, you know, when my time came, I was able to capitalize on it. But really the preparation part of it, he's taught me a lot at that point. How was this spring in particular different than last year mm -hmm. and your prep towards the Blue Bowl? Uh, yeah, this spring, you know, it's always different. You have a new team, like you said, new guys are coming in, trying to build a rapport with them, new receivers, um, just new guys that are stepping up. So it's really just getting a feel for everybody, you know, starting to create an identity for your new team and, you know, building throughout 15 practices, you want to just see a continuous approach. Not every practice is going to be great. You know, not every practice is going to be bad. It's kind of just like Coach Free says, that bumpy road, you know, throughout 15 practices, there's a lot that can go on, but you continue and improve. And when you come out and, uh, put everything on show in the blue and gold game, it's always a great time. Where do you feel like you've maybe improved the most since last year at this time to where you are today? I would say just overall, like offensive football, just grasping that. I think when you're able to understand a scheme and understand a, uh, you know, an offense, you're able to play faster with more clarity. So I think from a mental standpoint, and that just goes back to preparation, the way you study your routine, the way it goes on. I think that's really about to take steps.